Okay, good to hear that. Okay, so uh, I'm about to proceed as uh, most of you understood uh, what I said. Okay, so let me share my screen and we will see what's our goal for today. Okay, so. Okay, so as you can see, uh, today's goal is improving listening and reading skills, improving speaking skills by answering the questions and improving writing and speaking skills by summarizing of what has been taught in the class. Okay. So the very first, uh, let's go with the first chapter, okay? Uh, we have uh, chapter one, okay? So this chapter, I'm going to read out an article and based on the article, there will be questions in the next chapter. So I want you to listen carefully when I read and also uh, everyone that wants to read, uh, they can read also, okay? That would be great, uh, a great way of learning uh, how to read, uh in a, in a proper way okay so uh everyone that agrees to read okay uh everyone we we have to find uh i have to find okay so since it's, it is impossible for 53 participants in this room to uh to read or 65 participants to read okay i will see who wants to read and then uh we will proceed also we will help you know, uh, with the reading, with the reading class. Okay, so that's, let me start with the first, uh, with the reading, okay? And then uh, you can read after me. Uh, this, this is a cutscene part from Harry Potter's book, okay? It's a bit, uh, it's in British mostly, and uh, vocabulary is British, and I, I'll proceed. Uh, the speeding motorcycle took the sharp corner so fast in the darkness, that both policemen in the pursuing car shouted, wow, Sergeant Fisher slammed his large foot on the brake, thinking that the boy who was riding pillion was sure to be flung under his wheels. However, the motorbike made the turn without unsetting either of its riders, and with a wink of its red tail light, vanished up the narrow side street. We've got them now cried P.C. Anderson excitedly. That's a dead end. Okay, leaning hard on the steering wheel and crashing his gear, Fisher scrapped half the pain off the flank of the car as he forced it up all uh, the all the way in pursuit. There in the headlights sat their query, stationary at last after a quarter of an hour's chase. The two riders were trapped between a towering brick wall and the police car, which was now crashing towards them like some growling, luminous eyed predator. There was so little space between the car doors and the walls of the, the alley that Fisher and Anderson had difficulty extricating themselves from the vehicle. It injured their digni dignity to have an to inch grab like toward the miscreants. Fisher dragged his generous belly along the wall, tearing buttons off his shirt as he went, and finally snapping off the wing mirror with his backside. Okay, so we we uh, we listened. Okay, we uh, I believe you all heard. I believe you all heard of the uh, the article. So uh, anyone that would like to would like to would like to read to please speak up. Uh, raise your hands if you want to to uh, to read it up. Yes, sir, I want to read it. Okay, sure. So please go ahead and you may start. So we can we start? Uh, sorry. Yeah, I I will remove it. Okay. Let me just. So, uh, you you may start. Okay. Can you see it clearly? Yes, sir. Okay, sure. So you can, you may proceed. So can I start? Yeah, yeah, you can, you can start whenever you feel ready. Okay, sir. 
Okay. The speeding motorcycle took the sharp corner so fast in the darkness that both policemen in the pursuing car shouted, Oh, Sergeant Fisher shamed his last foot on the brake, thinking that the boy who was riding Pillion was sure to be flung under his wheels. However, the motorbike made the turn without unseating either of its riders and with a wink of its red daylight, vanished up the narrow side train. Uh, I do believe that I, I, I have problems hearing you. Anyone that can hear me also? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, so I don't know what yes, happened. Sir. Okay, so it had an uh, uh, internet connection. Anyone else that would like to read? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, want to read. Okay, I want to read. Okay, please uh, raise your hands in the chat box, okay, and uh, uh, tell the name, okay, and uh, we will speak, uh, okay, each, everyone will. Okay, uh, Jashan, you may start, please, everyone else, uh, let's listen to Jashan first, and then we will uh, hear out the others. Yes. The speeding motorcycle took the sharp corner so fast in the darkness that both policemen in the pursuing can shout a woe. Sergeant Fisher slammed his, his last foot on the brake, thinking that the boy who was riding Helen was shot to be flung under his wheel. However, the motorbike made the turn without unsitting either I of know. its either of its riders and with a wink of its red tail light vanished up the narrow side street we have got um, now cried pc anderson excitedly that uh, did that did end Okay, Jashan, uh, thank you for reading this paragraph. Okay, thank very good, too. very good work on, on, the, on the reading part. Uh, a little bit of suggestion, what I would say is to improve uh, your intonation and a bit of pronoun pronouncing the word uh, properly. Uh, it's, but in general, uh, your reading was, was correct, okay? But uh, a, a bit with the intonation, okay? Because English has its, its intonation, the ups and downs, you know? The speeding motorcycle took the sharp corner so fast in the darkness that both policemen... Okay, so I, I need you to play with that, okay? In general, uh, that was great. Okay, thank you for, for ringing out for us. Thank you. Okay, so uh, next is... Okay, let me see who is next. Uh, it was... Okay, I'm Mandeep Kaur. Okay, sorry if I mispronounce your word. Uh, so you you may uh, begin to read the other paragraph. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. No problem. Leaning hard on the steering wheel and crashing his gears, Fisher scrapped half the end of the flank of the car and pushed it up the level in the pursuit. There lies Dictionary at last after a quarter of a half chase, the between a towering brick wall and the police car, which was now crashing towards them like some growling luminous eyed predator. There was no little space between the car doors and the walls of the alley that Fisher and Anderson had difficulty exercising. <laughs> themselves the vehicle. It injured their dignity to have to inch crab like towards the miscreants. Fisher dragged his generous belly along the wall, turning buttons of shirt as he went, and finally snapping off the wings mirror with the backside. It is backside, correct. Okay, also very good in the reading part. 
uh, also need a bit of improvement. Okay, uh, some mispronounced words I, I, I could recall. Okay, but in general, it is also good. Okay, uh, we will see uh, with all of you uh, who, who, uh, who understood the, uh, the article. Okay, so now we have uh, Jasmine. Okay, sorry, Jasmine. Let's see. Okay, Jasmine. Uh, uh, yes, sir. Okay, so uh, who is uh, one one hundred forty fourteen thousand moga? Okay, uh, you can you can read. Read. Okay, so I see. I said I see that. Um, okay, Kushper, or I don't know uh, the. So from where can I start? Okay, Kamal, uh, Kamal Preet Kaur, uh, you, you can read. Uh, yes. Thank you, sir, uh, to get okay. me a chance to read. Yeah, no problem. Uh, sir, uh, where from I start? Uh, you can start from the beginning of the paragraph since we finished it. Okay, sir, thank you. No the speeding motorcycle took the sharp corner so fast in the darkness that both Policeman in the pursuing car shouted, Whoa, Sergeant, Sergeant Fisher slammed his large foot on the brake, thinking that the boy who was riding pillion was sure to be flung under his wheels. However, the motorbike made the turn without unseating either of its riders and uh, with a wink of its red tail light vanished up the narrow side street. Uh, we have got... Uh, now, cried PC Anderson excitedly. That is a dead end. Uh, leaning hard on the spring vehicle and crashing his gears, Fisher scrapped half the paint off the flank of the car as he forced it up the alleyway in his pursuit. Uh, there in the headlight. headlight okay, uh, so thank you very much. Thank you very much. I believe there are others. Okay, sorry to, to interrupt you. Okay, so uh, no there are others that that uh, that would like to to read also. Okay, since we don't have time for all all the uh, interested participants to read. Okay, so it uh, let me give me a brief. Okay, also very good with the pr pronunciation. It was the same as all of them. It was great reading, uh, mis some pronunciation and also the intonation is something that. Uh, all of you who read should work on, okay? Uh, but in general, it was great. Now let's have uh, one, we have two others, okay? And these will be the two last ones, okay? Is, uh, okay, uh, okay, 11, 11, okay, 114,000 MOGA, okay? So you can, uh, you can read. Yes. Sir. From where can I start? Uh, you can start from the from where uh, the lady left. Okay, so they're in in the headlights. So you can start from this paragraph. Okay, and and uh, you can finish the paragraph, and then we have another one that is waiting to read. Okay, sir. Thank you for giving me opportunity. No uh, there in the headlights sat their query stationary at last after a quarter of an hour's chase. The two riders were trapped between a towering brick wall and the police car, which, wa uh, which was now crashing towards them like some growling, humanist-eyed predator. All right. Okay, very good. Very good. Okay, it was a great reading skill. Okay, I give you that. Okay, now uh, we have the last participant that uh, wanted to read. Okay, and it was... Uh, yeah, Jasmine, Jasmine and Avni. Okay, you can read uh, the, the last paragraph. Yes, sir. there was a little space between the car doors and the walls of the valley alley that Fisher and Andrams had difficulty extracting themselves from the vehicle. Its inserts, their desert need to have the ends crab like chewards and miscrabs. So Fisher tracked his stainless valley along the wall, prairie's boards of his shirt as a vent, and finally snapping off the vent mirror with the backside. 
Okay, uh, so a little bit, okay, I see that while you were reading, uh, while you were reading, okay, you were a bit in a hurry, okay, so no need to hurry while reading, and while doing so, while hurrying it, uh, while uh, speeding up the reading process, you, uh, you know, you, you, sometimes you miss some of the, uh, the articles or some of the words, okay, and it was great, but, you, uh, yeah, okay. Now, uh, thank you everyone that that uh, participated in the reading part. Okay, you all did great. And uh, as I told everyone, okay, most of the people, most of the students that read, okay, uh, it's something that you should uh, improve your uh, pronunciation and also the intonation, okay? That, and uh, I, I do, do not know uh, where you stand with the understanding skills, so now we go to the chapter, to the other chapter, okay? We will see, we will answer the questions. Uh, we will answer the questions of based on the article or based on what we read, okay? So the very first questions is, okay, uh, what kind of shape took the motorcycle that surprised the patrol officers? Okay, anyone that would like to answer? Please raise your hand in the chat box. Okay, so uh, you can you can still you can still okay. So uh, the question is okay. What kind of a shape took the motorcycle that surprised the patrol officers? Okay, we can see. We can also okay. Let me just go up so we can you can you can find the answer here okay uh so we are looking about the shape of the motorcycle that surprised the patrol officers okay so please uh, someone that knows the answer okay speak up It takes a sharp uh, corner. Okay. Leaning hard on the steering wheel and crashing his gears, which was stabbed after. Okay. okay, so he took the shape of a. Okay, mm, let's go to, to the second question. Okay. What did Anderson felt like when he thought that he got him at the dead end? Okay, what did Anderson felt like? Okay, so I will type also, I will type also the, uh, you know, the, the questions in the chat box. Okay, and then we will, we will, we will see uh, the article again, and we will answer the questions together. So these are three questions that we have to answer in this session. Let's go. Okay. So the very first question is, okay, so let's answer the first question first. Okay. So you already know all the questions. So the question is, what kind of shape took the motorcycle that surprised the patrol officers? It was corner shape. Okay. Uh, okay. So, motorcycle so it, 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 is, it is not a correct. Okay. It is not a correct. Uh, it is not a correct. Uh, well, well structured like sentence. Them. Oh. Okay, so the speeding, okay, so let me just ask uh, questions. Inside. Okay. Okay, so let's let's go to the second one. Okay, so it took a sharp question. Okay, uh, now we have, what did Anderson felt like when he thought that he got him at the dead end? Okay. 
So how did Anderson felt when uh, he thought that he got them at the uh, dead end? As it had to do the lapera, they had the legitimate killer that the material there. Then no penna. Okay. So excitedly. Right. So how can you formulate uh, an, an, a, an, a, a sentence? So Anderson, when he when he uh, th thought that he got them, Anderson felt excitedly. Right. So he felt excitedly. Right. Okay. Uh, anyone uh, does uh, do any? Everyone agrees with the with the questions. Yes. Sir. Yes. Sir. Uh, okay. And we have the last uh, question. Okay, what happened at the end of the story? Okay, so this is this is the main uh, important question. Okay, please, uh, everyone, I would like everyone uh, who knows the answer. Okay, what happened at the end of the story? I want you all to speak up, not just uh, not just a short uh, answer, but I want a full uh, structured sentence. For example. Uh, Yes, I do know that uh, there are some some students waiting to join, but I do believe it is too late now. Uh, but I admit them. them. I d admit them all. Okay, so they missed the, the the big part. Okay, when the reading part, and where we had to. There was a little space between the car doors and walls of the alley. Okay, so how about how about we uh, everyone here? Okay, everyone so here. So snapping of the big mirror with his backside. The next screen, Karo. Okay, so how about? Uh, okay, so who who was talking? Uh, may May I know your name? What is this? Backside. Okay, so I want you to. Uh, Everyone, please answer. Please answer your. Uh, please answer uh, the questions into the chat box, and then I will I will see uh, everyone uh, how they structured their sentences. As it is very hard to to uh, lis listen uh, to listen uh, everyone's. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not doing that. Okay, so uh, let me just go to security. So, what is question? Can you please speak again? Okay, so uh, now you have to uh, summarize or to answer the questions into the chat. Okay, so you have to write your answer in the chat. Okay, so everyone. Show the paragraph again. Everyone, everyone that knows the answer of what happened at the end of the story, please write your sent your answers in the chat box, okay? And there I will see how you stand with the grammar, okay? And how well you understood the story. Okay, so everyone that understood and knows the answer, of what happened at the end of the story, okay, uh, you can answer or, so this is the question, okay, let me just read it out, let me type it. So me tell answer. Okay, so this is the, the, uh, the question, okay, what happened at the end of the story, okay. So snapping now, of the window mirror. Snapping of the wing mirror, right? So how can you formulate uh, a, a proper sentence? Okay, I want you to create a longer sentence with a proper grammar, okay? So, but and with the proper vocabulary. His valley along the wall, tearing buttons of her sh his shirt as well he went and finally snapping of the wing mirror with the backside. That is correct. Okay. Uh, so can you write it down? Okay. So others can have it. Others can have it for their references. Okay. Uh, may have the idea. 
on how to create another sentence? It is clear from final mm -hmm. level. Okay, so because uh, the next chapter is going to be uh, to summarize the story, okay? Based on the answers given, you may be to uh, you may be able to summarize the story. Okay, so these three questions: if if everyone uh, who who were active at the answer, okay, uh, now we have we have to answer the question. At the end of the story, they had difficulty to extricating themselves from the vehicle that ensured dignity, dragged their belly with a wall and snapping up the wing mirror. Okay. Uh, okay, so that, yeah, that is also a great, a great question. A great answer to the last question. Anyone else? He injured at last, right? Snapping up the wing mirror with his backside. There was a little space between the roads and the walls of the alley that fishermen and roads had difficulty expressing themselves for the vehicles, each insert at the end and tearing buttons of his shirt as he went and finally snapping off the wing mirror with, the, with his backside. That is correct. Okay. Uh, so anyone else that would like to speak out? Okay, now, okay, then let's go to the chapter number three. Okay, so uh, now they are connected. Okay, based on the answers given, you may be able to summarize the story. Okay, so, right. Okay, now we have chapter, chapter three. Okay, summarize the story using your own words. Okay, so I want you to summarize the story and if necessary, I will help you writing your sentences in the chat box at an advanced level. So can I read the next chapter? Uh, there, are, there is no other chapter. Okay, so what we have to do based on the answers given, okay, we have to summarize the story. Okay, so let me read out again. Okay, and please listen carefully. And uh, everyone, everyone that that knows uh, how to what to say something, okay, please uh, explain what is happening in in here, okay. So the speedy motorcycle took the sharp corner so fast in the darkness that both policemen in the pursuing car shouted, "Wow!" Sergeant Fisher slammed his large foot on the brake, thinking that. The boy who was riding Pillion was sure to be flung under his wheels. However, the motorbike made the turn without unseating either of its riders, and with a wing of its red taillight, vanished up the narrow sand street. We've got him now, cried PC Anderson excitedly. That's a dead end. Learning hard on the steering wheel and crashing his gears, Fisher scrapped have the paint of the flank of the car as he forced it up the other way in pursuit. There in the headlights sat their query, stationary at last after a quarter of an hour's chase. The two riders were trapped between a towering brick wall and the police car, which, now, which was now crashing towards them like some growling, luminous eye predator. There was so little space between the car doors and the walls with of the alley that Fisher and Anderson had difficulty 
extricating themselves from the vehicle. It injured their dignity to have to inch crab-like toward the miscreants. Fisher dragged his generous belly along the wall, tearing buttons off his shirt as he went, and finally snapping off the wing mirror with his backside. Okay, so I read all again, and I want you, uh, everyone that that has uh, that have taken notes, okay, uh, please take notes, okay. Uh, write down your, the, the summarization, okay. Write down uh, everything that you can, and then speak up, okay. So you have like uh, three minutes to uh, describe the event. And then whenever you feel ready, please speak up, okay, to summarize the uh, story. Okay, I believe I made myself clear. Okay, so I see uh, confirmation. Any uh, Anyone else that is uh, is willing to do so? So we have Jasmine who is uh, volunteering to summarize the story by writing and then speaking. Yes, sir. Okay, so you have uh, four minutes to do so or five minutes. Okay. And everyone else that uh, that can do so, please do it. Okay, we will, uh, we will have all our turns as we have, uh, we do have time. Uh, yes, yes. Uh, uh, please speak up. Uh, who is wanting to uh, summarize the story? Uh, please speak out. Okay, uh, summarize it. Okay, MK Kamal Preet Kaur. Okay, you can start. Uh, yes, sir. Okay. Uh, at the beginning of this topic, uh, the two name the two persons are uh, named. Uh, they included a policeman and Anderson. Uh, he saw that there is a there was a motorcycle, uh, which is right. which is uh, made of uh, different kinds of features, like as uh, uh, there was a large foot on the brake, uh, and uh, right. uh, the there was a shorty to be flung under his wheels, and uh, the that was like a different kind of uh, uh, motorcycle, uh, which made the turn without unseating. Uh, right. And there is a there was a, a red tail light, uh, but furthermore, uh, to saw that vehicle, uh, the Anderson uh, felt very excitedly uh, because uh, uh, he he could not uh, saw this kind of vehicle. And then uh, at the end of the story, uh, there was the no space between the car doors and the walls of the alley uh, that uh, a person named uh, Fisher and Anderson uh, find very difficult to uh, abstract themselves from the vehicle and uh, then it injured uh, their dignity uh, right. to have inch and then uh, Fisher dragged his generous belly along the wall uh, then finally uh, snapping off the wing mirror with his backside. Right, correct. Okay, so I see that you, uh, in the very first, very first thing, you summarized very well. 
about uh, the motorcycle that had too many gears and that the, there were uh, two other two policemen chasing him and you also explained it okay now everyone else uh, okay so anyone else that would like to to summarize the story Okay, anyone else? Okay, yeah, I see that they are waiting uh, in, in they are waiting in the waiting room, but uh, I don't I don't think that it is uh, it there is enough time to to let them or it's effective to to uh, let them in so um, i'm really sorry for them okay so i admit i'm admitting as much as i can as i see 57 are uh, 57 participants are in this class okay but let's get back to the topic okay uh we are about to summarize uh i want to to hear one uh, other student that is summarizing the story Okay, so no one else wants to summarize it. Love Preet Kaur. Okay, Love Preet Kaur. Uh, if you want to, so, if you want to, right? Yes. So may I start? Uh, yeah, yeah. So whoever wants to summarize the story, uh, please do so. Okay, yes. In starting, there were two riders on motorbike and two policemen in the car. In the darkness, they had an accident. Due to this, the motorbike made the turn without unseating either of two riders. At the end, there was very little space between car and ally, such that the policemen had very difficulty to extracting themselves from the vehicle. Then, Fisher dragged his generous belly along the wall, cheering buttons off his shirt as he went and finally snapping off the wing mirror with his backside. Uh, that's that was very advanced okay that was very good answer okay uh so you summarized it all by in uh, in a few some in a few sir, and a uh, simple sentence okay anyone else so can i tell yeah you can start so there are two two wives boy and boy in motorcycle and a Policeman in the policeman in the car. They are acid at night, and then there little space. Uh, the car downs the walls and the. Okay, I'm I'm having hard times of listening to you. Uh, is there any? Is is a, a internet connection problem? Finally, because snapping of the wing mirror with the, his backside okay so uh can you please uh, start off again uh we 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 couldn't tell uh i couldn't hear you what uh, what uh you were telling okay i'm really sorry about that i think there was an internet connection problem can you summarize it once again yes sir yeah so there are two uh, two boys uh, in motorcycle and two policemen in the car right. they had accident at the dark night at the end there were little space between the car and between the car doors and the walls of the alley that to fisher and anderson had difficulty themselves for the vehicle they enjoyed fisher dragged his generous belly along the wall tearing buttons of his shirt as he went and finally snapping off wing mirrored with the backside that is correct 
Okay. Uh, very well. Very well. Thank you for for summarizing it for 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 I for I for us. I see that you have understood it. Uh, the 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 whole story, the 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 clear image of it. Anyone else that would like to summarize it? May I go ahead? Yeah, you can start. Yes. At the very best, very first beginning of the story, there was a, a motorcycle and a car. Uh, there, there was an accident between the two. And in a short uh, short street, and there was an accident between the two. And uh, uh, the space was very uh, short between the car and the uh, first, uh, Anderson. Uh, she, uh, he was not able to get extract from the uh, from the street and the wall. Uh, from the street of the wall and the car and uh, at the last uh, she got stuck in the uh, in the in that space or uh, she had she had uh, uh, sorry uh, he had he had uh, he had injuries on his body and uh, her, his uh, his belly was got stuck with the uh, with the uh, scar and uh, and la at last, uh, her, his shirts buttons were off, and uh, uh, finally snapping off the wing mirror from the his uh, from his backside. That is correct. Okay, so I believe that's it for for uh, summarizing the story. Everyone that summarized the story, I uh, I'm I'm very I'm I'm very happy that you understood this. Okay, I didn't know the level of yours. And I do believe that you are trying to improve your uh, your speaking skills and uh, listening skills, as I uh, as I was told, and uh, you did very good. Okay, everyone shared their point of view, and uh, very well done. It is a very advanced. It is a very high level. Uh, the the this this uh, article that we we heard. Okay, it is British. And there are a lot of unknown unknown words that that makes it hard for you to understand. But even even though it was very hard, um, some of you uh, made it out to summarize it and to uh, to answer the question. So I I congratulate you for that. Okay. Now uh, since we are uh, about to end, okay, uh, about the end. To end the 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 this session, okay. Uh, I want you uh, now is the 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 question time. So everyone that has questions, please uh, speak up, okay. And I'm here to answer you to your questions. Whether, um, okay, sure. Yeah, uh, I want to know about that. Could we have the, these sessions uh, two uh, two times in a week? Uh, yeah, we can have these sessions two times in a week. Yes, I uh, can. Please do that. Uh, it, it will be very grateful and very helpful to us. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm glad to hear that. Yeah, yeah, okay. So yeah, it's, it, it, will be, uh, it will be possible to, to do this uh, two times a week. I would be very grateful to, us, uh, to you, sir. Thank you so much. No problem. It's my, it's my duty to do so. So no need to thank me. Can I speak, sir? Yes, sure. Uh, well, sir, uh, there could be uh, two classes in every week uh, at uh, Wednesday and Saturday. Uh, and you, you could have these type of classes. And these type of classes uh, might be very helpful uh, for uh, us uh, to further studies. And uh, I'm very thankful to you uh, yeah. uh, to take uh, this type of classes for us. Thank you, sir. No problem. Uh, no problem. Okay. So yeah, as I as I uh, told, also I I am available at that time, uh, Wednesday and Saturdays. But we have to uh, to schedule a time which is uh, you know uh, appropriate for both of us from both of our sides. Excuse me, sir. Yes. Could you please give your manual introduction to us? Uh, manual introduction. Yeah, sure. So, uh, example, 
this was just uh, a letter, uh, uh, you know, uh, a class that I prepared uh, so I can see where you stand with your English. Okay, uh, it was not expected from my side that there will be there would be so many participants. Okay, uh, from from uh, interested so many interested participants uh, to my class. And uh, so what I will do next example, I will do a, a same thing, but a same class, but probably I will modify it. Uh, I will modify it and I, we will start off with something uh, simple. Okay, not with the Thank British you. one. Thank you. No problem. And then we can go to this advanced level. So when I'm uh, in, in another class, when when I will come uh, with the with the uh, materials, uh, I will make sure that they would be uh, the same, but uh, with a little modi modify modifications that will be more helpful to you. Yeah, I was uh, I was asking about your like your introduction. Could you please give that to us? Uh, yeah, so, uh, you know, you, uh, you know, you want to know, uh, who I am. Okay. Or my, my professional background. Yeah, okay. So yeah, I yeah. am, yeah, I'm, yeah. my name is, uh, Lautra Mayeti. I have been teaching, uh, since, uh, 2020, October or September. And, uh, I did one-on-one -on -one sessions. Uh, I never, I never did, uh, classes that has, uh, more than one a student but uh it's something that i can i i learned it this is the first time and uh you know i i worked at native camp as a as a teacher and uh yeah i'm a computer science student and also a freelance writer you know i i used to write articles by myself and uh that will will uh you know will give me enough knowledge to how to create another class for you to for you for uh, you students to be helpful thank you so much that is very knowledgeable okay uh, you're welcome and thank you for for uh, for saying that okay any other questions yes sir okay sure you can uh, you can go ahead and and uh, Talk. Thank you, sir. I have a question regarding the speaking. Uh, that is, how can we fill the gaps in uh, while speaking? Okay, sure. So as I told you, as I told you, uh, I will come up in, in another time that you may be able to uh, write down uh, your sentences. Uh, but what I want you to do uh, next time is that you come with a pencil and a notebook and when when uh for example if there is uh if there is required from you to summarize the story then you have to write it down and then to speak it up or filling the gaps is i don't think that is a, a, it is possible to fill fill the, the gaps as uh, you do not have access to my uh, document the only thing that would be is for me to write your answers down into <coughs> the gap station. Okay, so I believe that uh, that that's something that should be solved. Okay, I will try to to, to do that too. Okay, sir. Thank you. Mm -hmm. 